invite Danny to lead the praise. Before I start this song, I would like to read uh, a word of God from Numbers 6, 24 to 26. The Lord bless thee and keep thee. The Lord make his face shine upon thee and be gracious unto thee. The Lord lift up his countenance upon thee and give thee peace. Amen. So, blessings. So this song is really close to my heart. Even if I hear it like 10 times a day, I would, I would still want to hear the song because it's just so good. It just speaks about the blessings of a God. It's a very simple song. It's just the word of God, plain word of God that's put into the lyrics of the song. So, I, I, I know this may come out super weird, but how many of us pray for our future generations? Can you raise your hands? Okay, amen. We have some people who pray for the future generations, for their partners. Who, how many of us pray for our future partners, life partners, people who are going to get married? Not, not asking for God to give me that beautiful girl, no. I'm talking about God to fulfill His plan in our lives. How many of us do that? Amen. We have them again. So, so I would like to tell you something. So, my parents, uh, they got married. They, my dad, he waited uh, like, I think, 12 years. <laughs> I think nine years, something before marriage. For marriage, to get married to my mom. And then, so this... The reason why he waited was not because he wasn't getting any proposals, no. He was waiting for the fulfillment of the plan of God in his life. Amen? So, why, why, why do we need the plan of God? What is the reason that we need the plan of God in our lives? Some of you may think that he's perfect for me. He has the best things. I mean, he likes what I like and he dislikes what I like, dislike and we are so perfect for each other, but but God may say, my daughter or my son, he's not the one for you, or she's not the one for you. We, we have to ask God for his will in our lives. And in important things like a marriage, in studies and in other things also, we, will like, we have to ask God for his will in our lives. And when God gives you the will, maybe the girl may not, or the boy may not have your same likes and dislikes, maybe, they may have a different, totally different mindset, but, but when God gives you His will, and when you follow God's will, the blessings will follow your generations. The blessings will follow your lives. Amen. And you will have peace in your life. You will have peace in your families. And so, my dear brothers and sisters, I would like to request you all to close your eyes right now. And we're just going to surrender our generations, surrender the future life partners, Whoever it may be, don't take the name. Ask God for His will to be done in our lives. You may feel like your girlfriend or your boyfriend or someone you like to be the perfect one, but ask God for His will to be perfected in your life. Amen. Amen. So let's all just pray now. Let's all close our eyes, lift up our hands to the heavens. Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus, you are the creator of the heavens and the earth, Lord. Lord Jesus, we come before you, Lord Jesus. We have gathered here to experience you, Father God. We need you in our lives, Father God. More than anything, more than anything, we need you in our lives, Father God. We want your will to be perfected in our lives, Father God. Lord, we surrender our lives into your hands, Lord Jesus. Lord, I surrender all my brothers and sisters who have gathered here, Father God. I surrender their lives into your hands, Father God, Jesus. Lord, we surrender their future generations, Father God, Jesus. Lord, we surrender everyone into your hands, Father God. Lord Jesus, let your will be perfected in our lives, Father God. Let your will be perfected and let your will be done in our lives, Father God. When Mother Mary accepted the will in her life, there was blessing. Jesus was born into this world because Mother Mary accepted. Mother Mary told, my God, let your will be done in our lives. Amen. Amen. Let's all scream. Amen. Amen. Come on. Come on. Louder. Come on. Amen. 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 I can't hear you. Amen. 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 Let's all start the song.
shine upon you. Make His face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn His face towards you and give you peace. We receive it and we agree. Amen. you have nowhere to go it may seem like your life your life has come to an end trust me my dear brothers and sisters offer it to our Lord Jesus and he will take care of it for you amen 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 so let's sing this may his favor be upon you once more 
Bless your families, my dear brothers and sisters. Bless your children. You may be super young. I know that. Even I'm super young. But bless your families, the future generation, and your children, and their children, and their children, and their children. Their children. Bless your generations, my dear brothers and sisters. When God blesses, He blesses sevenfold. When he blesses, he blesses and falls. And when he causes, he causes and falls. So bless your generations. This blessing will remain with your generations for a long, 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 long time to go. So bless him. Bless your generations. I want everyone to sing the song. The song is a blessing of your generations. This song is for you. It's for you. Bless your generations. It's for you. It's for you. It's for you. generations and your family and your children and the children and the children may his presence go before you and behind you and beside you all around you and within you he is with you he is with you in the morning and the evening and you're coming and you're going and you're weeping and rejoicing he is for you, 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 my brothers and sisters. He will never let you down. Amen without the instruments. Only with the keyboard. gathered here father god whatever they might be undergoing right now father god lord we surrender everything into your hands father god lord jesus you take complete and total control over their hearts their minds and their emotions father god jesus you know their struggles you know their pains and you know what you know their worries father god you know uh, everything lord jesus even if our closest friend doesn't know what we're undergoing father god you know our heart father god you know everything about us, Father God. Even before we have a word in our mouth, you know it completely, O oh Lord Jesus. Amen. You go before us and you go behind us. Amen. And you never let us go, Father God. Amen. Even though we are like the prodigal son, we, Lord Jesus, commit sins again and again and again and again. And we fail, Lord Jesus. We fail. Yet, your love never fails, Lord Jesus. Your love never fails us, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for this unconditional love, Father God. Thank you, Lord, for this unforgiving love, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for dying on the cross. Thank you, Lord, for shedding a precious and living blood and giving us your eternal life, Father God. Lord, we're not worthy to stand before you here, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus, we are sinners, Lord Jesus. Lord, we need your pardon in our lives. We need you, Lord Jesus. We need you in everything, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Father. Praise you, Father. Thank you, Lord.